Why, hello, biggin. On a chilly night like this, there's only one thing that I would like to do. And that is to read you some cowboy stories. Tonight, we have a tale. A tale of discovery. A tale of despair. A tale from the cowboys that forged to the Old West. And what this tale is called is the bandana. Actually, I'm not going to read that one. It doesn't sound that good. We're going to read the story of Huey and the Wagon Cook by the fireside. Chuck Wagon Cooks were expected to be contrary. It was part of their image, their defense mechanism against upstart young cowpunchers who might challenge their authority to rule their Dutch oven kingdoms 50 or so feet in all directions from the Chuck box. Woe unto the thoughtless cowboy who rode his horse within that perimeter and kicked up dust in the kitchen. The custom was so deeply ingrained that not even the owner of a ranch would easily violate this divine right of kings. Even so, what if would you rather decide past what been decide for because that? The Huey Callaway convinced twelve because that twelve even decided as have been. He considered dough belly a despot. Worse than that, are you kidding me? Dough belly was not even a very good cook. Without has been that the gruel bean bake horse decide that. And that has been Cowboy Stories. Brought to you by Barry Moser and read to you by Commissioner Ferg. I'm going to poke this fire a little bit before I poke you, you biggin'.